Hey what's up you guys, Realist here and in today's video I'll be showing you guys how to select the Faceit map pool that you will be playing in. And just keep in mind that you have to be Faceit Premium when you're doing this. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So usually you're going to be here in the CSGO dashboard and what I want you to do is you want to click CSGO 5v5 here on matchmaking. And right here you see maps and you can actually select at least three maps and only those three maps are the ones that can be showing up in the veto phase. Uh, keep in mind that it will take longer to find a game when you're using this because I'm not sure how they do it But yeah, it's gonna take longer. So for example, you don't want to play cash and nuke and train you can just remove that and You know go play and queue a solo or if your team has premium then you can go queue as a team So why this is useful is for example your team's just practicing uh, Nuke train and cash then you can just go ahead and check nuke train Cash, remove Mirage, and you know, just queue with these three maps. And whatever you land in, you're gonna be able to practice your game, right? So, this is a, a very useful feature, I believe. And I just figured out that I can actually do this because I'm premium. We have it over to my screen, and here you can see that I'm face it prem premium. It costs about a hundred dollars for a year, and it's pretty good. This video is not sponsored by Facebook, but yeah, it really just you know encourages me to grind more because there's you know these missions that you can do for face it points and you can exchange the points for CSGO items like here look you can order multiple things even you can order you can even order gears but you know we all want skins cuz i think we all have gears but here they have gears here hardware so you can actually get these which is actually insane dude you can get gears by playing the game but you have to pay for it of course so yeah that is all for today's video guys i hope you guys learned something new and if you did, please leave a like and subscribe.